vicious. East Coast, the six fours hitting switch. It's not a conflict of interest. Cut him with the business. West Coast rocking them Timberlands. Deep up in the trenches. It's no difference. Fourth and inches. I'm finna hit a lick and handle business. I got a down. She real vicious. Rock a bye, baby. No witness. This is not even a conflict. You no nonsense. Die the same way in Brooklyn and Compton. But with that gang gang, they make a profit. On top. Stay poppin'. Look. See, I was the high school slick, Rick, I was styling. Fat gold chain with an African medallion. Hip hop connoisseur and rolling 20 gripping. Rap game real tight, freestyle was magnificent. All about the clout and all about my dividends. Them older couldn't tell me different. I need a roundaway girl to live with. Showtime at the Apollo. I'm, I'm about the bottom. Take two and pull out a little for my. Who won't live to see them all? If God for me, who could be against me? I guess all of that's against me. They the ones stirring up the conflict. They try to make it out like I'm conflicted. First off, let me talk my got a couple things I gotta cross off my list. How you in? Somniac for sleeping on my it's a bad soundtrack, read the script. Ah, uh, born in the motherland, headed straight down to the south. Tennessee mornings with pops, working three jobs. I knew that they struggled to get it, that's why I wanted to get it. That f***ing better, you get it, treat it like the law. And I'ma need commission for this hit. Last laid the canvas and I painted over it. I don't need a vision board to show you I'm the I'm betting on myself, count the chips. Got it, made some choices for a profit. That's my logic. I'ma take it to the coffin, just being honest. Try to sing my shit like Titanic and leave me with Jack. Hope I be panicking, but I rose to the top. Isn't it funny that the is built like a Maserati? Yoga folding like origami. What? I walk the walk. I talk the talk. I be saying what I want. When I had no deposit, closet was looking real bare. Now I made a deposit, my closet's looking super rare. Uh, drove it really far. Crazy how did this happen? Wishing on a star. I ain't talking Mardi Gras With a little patience, you'll be eating Buddha Khan What you want? What you want? Made some choices for a profit That's my logic I'ma take it to the coffin Just being honest Never let a man affect your stack like that And if you're getting toxic, tell the boy fall back If it was back then, I'd be tripping off that Took a little time just to get me on track Uh, I went from snotty to snobby, got it like uh I'm mean to everybody Move if you call me, please, or don't even bother me. They said, oh, my apologies. They keep calling and calling. I keep stalling and stalling. Rookie of the year, my career is no balling. Got it. Made some choices for a profit. That's my logic. I'm going to take it to the coffin. Just being honest. Show you how to show up and show out and surf the crowd. 
That my Brooklyn cause he shot racks outside. C12 911. Good to the Riazzi, we still outside. Mine on the riches, hard in the trenches. You can't throw dirt on the underground, we thrive in it. Ghana boy stocks on the rise, Charlie. This flex no day ready. See, we run out of ride nobody with. We the ones who started with it. Translation, Yanni had to buy Yanni and Yanni hits. <laughs> this goes so hard, even the ops go with it. Uh huh. That's how you know we lit. Yeah, yeah. Grrr. Uh -huh. Tonight, it's the National Football League. Super Bowl 58. coverage of the National Football League is on the air. We count down to kickoff in what should be an epic one here, as it'll be the AFC champion Kansas City Chiefs taking on the NFC champions, the Washington Commanders. Super Bowl week is over, and away we go in Super Bowl 58. This taken in at the goal line. And he'll take it up past the 25 to the 26-yard line. Here are the commanders for their first drive of the game. And they will be led out by their second-year quarterback. And there are a lot of quarterbacks who had terrific careers. Think about guys like Phillip Rivers, Randall Cunningham, Dan Fouts, Warren Moon. But they never got to a Super Bowl. Yet here he is in his second NFL season already getting his chance. And we harken back to Dan Marino, another superstar, made it in his second year, lost the game, and never made it back again. Off 
the play fake. Rich. This is caught by his tight end, Logan Thomas. And they get him down, but not before he takes it across the 40-yard line. 17 yards that time at a Washington first. Well, the first drive here and the first time that we've called the big tight end's name, but I, I can assure you this, Charles, it, it won't be the last. No, it won't, because when he gets going, now it opens up opportunities on the perimeter because that'll draw the defense towards him in the middle of the field. Now your wide receivers are getting involved as this game goes on. On first and 10, Rich looking for McLaurin, and he's got him. And they'll get this down to around the 47-yard line. for the first time here with Brown. And he'll be taken down at the 44-yard line. And able to push his way forward here for a good little game. Shotgun handoff to Brown here. And he gets it down to the 32. Six yards the pickup, and that's a first down. Operating from the gun. Rich. Thomas has got it. Complete. And he'll be brought down at about the 23-yard line. to throw on second down. Rich. Now he's forced out. Now the ball comes loose, and it's picked up by the Chiefs. And now off to the races, down the right side. And he has brought this one back. A fumble recovery for a Chiefs touchdown. Striking first in any game is very important, but on this stage, the biggest of stages in the Super Bowl, that's huge. You fully expect the other team to battle all the way through, but when you're the one setting the pace, jumping out in front, that has to feel great for the entire organization. Harrison Butker is on for the extra point. And his kick is good to make it 7-0 KC. The scoop and score, always an exciting play in football, and we witnessed it there, grabbing it off the ground and then rumbling it into the end zone for six. So here's the kickoff now as he'll get it again following that fumble return for a score. Taking it about the one. A solid return, pretty good field position. They'll start at the 32. The commander's going to retake the field for drive number two. They trail early on in this Super Bowl as they come up first and 10. Throwing to start the drive. Rich, open man is Antonio Gandy Golden. Working with a second and four. A handoff for Gibson. Four yards, the pickup, first down. Handing it off to Brown. On a determined run there as he's going to take this all the way down near the 40. They get 17 there. Good for a commander's first down. Good push up front and that run in between the tackles. Let's play the leverage game here. Offensive line just got lower than the defensive front, and they're able to get their pads on them and move them backwards and create space for their running back to roam. So now first and 10 in Chiefs territory. At the 41. 
right back to Brown. And he gets this to the 35. Good for a gain of five. Looking to throw on second down. Rich. And the Chiefs are going to get him. Chris Jones breaking through to get him to the ground. It's a loss of seven. Now that's a heck of a moment for your first sack of the game because if this long drive ends without a touchdown because of that sack, we're going to look back and say that might be one of the biggest plays of this contest. Now on third down, an extra DB out there for the Chiefs. Operating from the gun, Rich. And looking for McLaurin, but this is intercepted. Picked off by Legereus Sneed. And the Chiefs are going to have it here at their own 32-yard line. Well, that's a drive killer right there. Not a really confident throw either. This one was kind of up for grabs, and it's going to come down the hands of the wrong team. The KC offense set to go, led as always by the gunslinger, a former MVP in this league. It's Patrick Mahomes. And no doubt he's living out a dream right now. He's had dating back to his first days of playing football as a kid. But he certainly can't get lost in the moment right now. There's still a Super Bowl to be played, and his offense, they're looking to him to be their leader. You can take it all in when it's over. Right now, you've got the biggest game of your life to win. The drive will begin with a run by Edwards Hilaire. And he'll scratch out only about a yard up to the 32. On second and nine, Mahomes to the right side, and he's got more complete. And he gets this up across the 35 before he's out of bounds. They get six. That'll leave him with third and four. Here's Mahomes to throw. Complete the tight end, Kelsey. And he'll go out of bounds. It appears right at the 45. First and 10, it's Edwards Alaire with it. And he's got it across the midfield, striping into Washington territory. The last run got nine. That leaves him with second and a yard. They fake the give. Now Mahomes. Trying to fit it into Moore, but it's intercepted. And the Commanders are going to get the football back at their own 17. Well, right now, it's clearly the defenses that are stealing the spotlight in the biggest stage of sports. That's only the fourth time ever, Charles, that we have seen teams trade interceptions on back-to-back -back drives in Super Bowl history. Something so rare, yet special, that we're watching because typically the teams we see playing here on Super Bowl Sunday, they're the ones that know how to limit turnovers. Just goes to show how talented both of these defenses are that they're still coming through and forcing miscues for a Lombardi trophy on the line. They'll start on the ground here on first down. And he goes across the 20 to the 22. Here's second and five now from the 22. Back to throw. Rich. Over the middle, it's Thomas. And he's got it past the 30 before he's hit and dropped. So they'll come up first and 10 now from the 33. They'll give this up the middle to Brown. And this is going to be a commander's first down as he's got this up to the 45-yard line. Well, they came into this game saying it was important that they set the tone and show that they can run the football. I believe that they've done that here in the first quarter. Draw play for Brown. He'll get this up to the 47 and brought down there. To throw on second down, Rich. 
And a quick throw here, that's complete. And he'll be brought down with a first down as the tackle's made at the Chiefs' 42. Straight ahead, Gibson. And he'll take this ahead for about four. Second down coming up. Following the pickup of four, here's second and six. Looking to throw. Rich. Firing quickly here, and that's complete. And he'll be hauled down at about the 30-yard line. On first down, Rich. Over the middle, it's complete. And they're going to get this down to about the 17-yard line here. So from the 17 now, here's a first and 10. This is Brown on the draw play. And he's eaten up at the line of scrimmage. Might have gotten the yard down to the 16. Looking to throw on second down. Rich toward the end zone, but that's going to wind up incomplete. After an incomplete pass on second down, that'll leave him trying to convert on third and nine. Operating from the gun. Rich, he finds his man complete. That's Thomas. And the commanders are going to have first and goal as they try to finish off this drive with six points. A very important third down conversion right there because when you're trailing and find yourself this deep in enemy territory, the kicker's not even part of your thought process. You got to make it pay off with six. Nice connection right there to set up first and goal. They try and run for it here with Brown. No gain there, and it's going to set up second and goal. Back to throw. Rich looking for McLaurin, and he's got him. Touchdown, Washington. Two yards on the touchdown there. And the Commanders are an extra point away from tying up this Super Bowl. And all about timing there on that short slant, Charles. Exactly right. That was timed up so well. The route, the throw, touchdown. On here, Brandon McManus for the point after. It's up and good. So these teams match touchdowns here in the first quarter, and we're tied 7-7. So that drive spans 13 plays, and it's finished off by a Terry McLaurin touchdown. So I'll leave it at seven now as they kick it away. Fielded just outside the goal line. And a decent return out to the 27-yard line. Kansas City taking the field for their second drive. They had the interception last drive, led to the tying touchdown. So 7-7 the score as they begin first and 10. Go, go. Here's Edwards Alaire as they will start on the ground. And he's going to be hemmed in and brought down right at the line of scrimmage. So after the run for no gain, here's second and 10. Now Mahomes. But he cannot avoid the pressure as the Washington pass rush gets home. Yannick Ngakwe credit him with a sack, and it goes as a loss of six. These two teams all tied after one. Welcome back to the date on the calendar. We circle every year, Super Bowl Sunday. Brandon God and Charles Davis here with you as we get set to begin quarter two. Now on third and long, they'll look to throw. The connection here with Nelson Aguilar. And this effort will not get it done. He stopped well short of the first down at the 29. So they'll get eight out of that completion. And it'll be fourth down. Here's the Chiefs punter now, as he's on to punt for the first time tonight. A punt 
the 46, a return of five. And it will be Washington football now with a first and ten. Now this offense back out and set to go for their next drive. Well, the football changing hands here as this offense takes a field. Charles, they'd be fine with more of the same on this upcoming drive. Last time out, they found the end zone for six. And they're certainly hoping for more of the same, but the game plan, I doubt it'll just be a carbon copy of the last drive because I think this offense is ready to break out some new wrinkles and try some new... And now this is intercepted. My goodness. Trent McDuffie with a pick. And the Chiefs are going to take possession of the football. Before we came up to the booth, the last thing he said as we were walking off the field, want to play mistake-free football. Well, that just went out the window there with a pick. And do you remember what you said to me when we were walking up to the booth after he said that? You're like, oh, fatal last words. Every time we hear that, things tend to fall apart a little bit, and that's what we saw there. Didn't get enough on that throw, and it turned into an interception. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. So after the INT, here's Mahomes finding more on the out route for the completion. And he is out of bounds, but not before he's inside the 30. They still need about the length of the football here, maybe a little less as they come up on second and inches. And he is met in his tracks behind the line of scrimmage. They go backwards there two yards, and second and one is now third and three. No daylight for him to run through there, and he ran into the defensive tackle, and that guy blocks a whole lot of daylight as it is. He is truly a big man who just made a big play. Edwards Alaire, they'll try to run for it. And he's able to get the first here as he's taken down at the 25. Give him the third down conversion, five yards on the play. That's how you get right up off of the map because on the last play, they stoned him in the backfield and dropped him for a loss. But he's the type of guy that scared me a little bit because he's not daunted. Just got right back up, showed some confidence, and picked up a first down with his very next run. First down, Mahomes. And they'll set up the screen to Edwards Alaire. And he'll be brought down at about the 23 yard line. <laughs> Throwing again on second down. Mahomes finding Edwards Alaire once again. And he maybe makes it back to the line of scrimmage. That's it. Nothing on the screen that time. Now it's third down. So nothing there on the screen that time. That means all that great acting they tried on offense went for naught, didn't it? Because you have to try and influence them. Make them think that you're doing something else. Make them think that they can get to the passer by letting them by and then setting up the screen and getting downfield. Didn't happen at all. Give a lot of credit to the defense for not tumbling to that one. So on fourth down, Mahomes off, Harrison Butker on for the Chiefs field goal. From the right hash, it's a 35. Oh, look at this, a flip to the kicker. He's gonna try to run for it. And they're able to pick up the first and keep possession. Here's a first and 10 at the 14 yard line. Mahomes on the give to Edwards Alaire. And effective running here. He'll take it down inside the 10. The last run got six, now second and four. Mahomes now to throw. Forced out to his left. And he takes this into the end zone for a Chiefs touchdown. Patrick Mahomes, an eight-yard touchdown run. And the Chiefs have taken the lead. That was not a designed run. It was supposed to be a pass, but it turned into an exceptional run. What a scramble for a touchdown. Butker now to add the extra point. And he 
he's got it. It's now a 14-7 ball game. A good drive that time as they go nine plays in all. And it was all capped by Patrick Mahomes using his legs to get in the end zone. Now after the touchdown, here's Butker on to kick it away. And Gibson decides against bringing it out. Here comes the commander's offense back onto the field. This offense returning out there, and really, you remember the last drive, Charles, it was over before it even began. They threw the interception on the very first play. And what that means is for all these guys, it's been a while since they've been out there going full speed, so they've got to get everyone back out there, run a couple of your go-to plays, make sure you get your offense oiled up a little bit. They've got to be able to start fast, but they've got to be efficient as well. Especially the quarterback. So the completion good for just three. And that'll bring up second down. Well, it's time for them to be good teammates right here. And what I mean by that is possess the ball for a little while. Get at least two first downs. Give their defense a chance to settle down a little bit after they give up a touchdown. Now a give left side. Brown with it. And he'll be brought down right around the 37. 59 yards rushing for him now in the first half of this Super Bowl. I don't care what anyone says. I want a big time back in in this kind of yardage each and every time I step on the field. A tone setter, these guys are hard to find. Line of scrimmage, the 37 on first and 10. They go right back to the ground here in Brown. That's a good acceleration there as he's across midfield to the 48-yard line. That one going against the guard, Andrew Norwell. They keep it on the ground. Again, it's Brown. And he'll get up near the 45. They'll spot it at the 44. Off play action. Rich. He completes this one to Terry McLaurin. And he'll be out of bounds just shy of the 40. Three catches for him now in the first half of this Super Bowl. It's a first down. Timing is everything, and they work on this cut all the time. They work on all the timing patterns, and this time it paid off for them. Worked him to the center of the field, cut it to the outside, ball's delivered, gets both feet down for the completion. So now first and 10 in Chiefs territory at the 41. Operating from the gun. Rich, flush to his right. And that is caught on the right sideline, but out of bounds, says the line judge. The throw took him a little too far. It's second down. Throwing again on second and 10. Rich. And he will find his man, Samuel. And he'll be brought down with a first down as the tackle's made at the Chiefs 16. A really nice gain of 25 yards. You know I'm going to lean towards the defender, right? You know I'm going to do that. I know. That's a tough situation for him as I see it. But the truth of the matter is, that ball was not streaking towards him. Had a little arc on it. He's got to find a way to get his head around and make a play on the football. So the ball down to the 16 here for first and 10. Inside the red zone here. They'll look to throw. Eluding the pressure right. And he takes it in. Touchdown, Washington. A 16-yard touchdown run. And the Commanders are an extra point away from evening this one up. Well, the defensive coverage was good, so good, he just decided to make a play of his own, and it worked out. Yeah, you often wonder if they think to themselves, was the coverage too good to allow him to run the football? I think you'd rather take your chances with him doing exactly that, and he beat him on that play all the way to the end zone. Now McManus for the extra point. And we've got a good one, Bruin. We're all knotted up at 14. 
And so that drives seven plays in length and was polished off by the touchdown run from the 16-yard line. This one tied at 14 now as he sends this one away. Fields it right around the goal line. And he returns this to the 22. So now here are the Chiefs as their offense makes their way back out onto the field. And right now, we've got a little bit of an offensive masterpiece going on both sides, moving the football, scoring points. It's almost like somebody put the defense on rookie mode in this one. I mean, we haven't even left the first half, Charles, and we're certainly on pace for a shootout. An excellent start for both offenses. The fans have to be enjoying this to seeing all these points go up on the board. As a former defender, you know I'm not enjoying this at all, but right now, both these teams just trading haymakers. Let's see if anyone slips up first. Can anyone counter with a nice little jab and get things going in their direction? His second catch in the Super Bowl, and it's good enough for a first down. to throw, it's Mahomes. A quick throw there, gonna be batted away and incomplete. So after the incompletion on first, now second and 10. And again, it's Mahomes. The tight end, Kelsey has it over the middle. That'll leave him with a third and two coming up. They got eight yards there. They'll run here with Edwards Hilaire. And he's got the first down yardage before being taken down at midfield. It'll go as a gain of six that time, and it moves the chains as well. They had yet to run the ball at all on this drive, but third and short definitely was a great time to dial one up. Now it's Mahomes. Escaping the pressure right. Trying to fight his tight end, Kelsey, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Cameron Curl. And the Commanders are going to take possession of the football. Let's go, let's go. Well, I get what he was trying to do. He was moving to his right and trying to shift the coverage. But instead, he shifted the coverage also to the right and threw right into it for an interception. A look at Washington as they come onto the field. They'll have very good starting field position here as they try to break our tie, and they start first and 10. So here's a first and 10 at the 38. Throwing to start the drive. Rich, and he's got it. And he lost the football. And it's picked up by the Chiefs. And his guys are going to take over at the 31-yard line. And now, meanwhile, after the dust settles on the fumble, we've got an injured player here as well. While they come out and take a look at him, we will step aside for just a moment. And now, as with every potential turnover, they're going to take a second look at this just to make sure. Now the question, was the knee in fact down before this ball comes loose? And is the video convincing enough to overturn it? A lot of factors here. Remember, you also need clear possession of the football afterwards. This is a tough one to overturn. So that one overturned. They say the knee was down, and that will not be ruled a fumble to throw on second down. Rich, he'll look underneath and finds Brown. And only able to get two here, stopped at the 30. <laughs> Off the play fake, Rich. And that is incomplete. Oh, he had a defender right there with him to force that to the ground. And fourth down now coming up. That's an excellent play by the defender. He diagnosed that one, closed quickly, and helped force the incompletion. Here we go, here we go. 
They'll try and run for it with Brown. And he's got the first as they'll bring him down at the 28-yard line. The fourth down run successful. Now they look to pay it off on first down. Looking to throw. Rich. This will be caught by Brown. And they're going to get this down inside the 20. Looking to throw on second down. Rich buying time to his left. And he'll get it here to the 10-yard line. A good decision in the end. The pull and run gets him nine yards and a first. As he came to the line of scrimmage, he knew he didn't need much to reset the chain. So when he saw the space he needed, no hesitation. He went to the marker and got his guys a first down. So not quite a first and goal. It's first and 10 from the 10. Back to throw. Rich. This pass complete to McLaurin going across the middle. Second down, ball on the three. First down marker at the one-yard line. They will toss to Brown. And that play going absolutely nowhere as he's belted before he could get out of the backfield. It'll be a loss of a full three yards there, and it also brings up third down. on the clock in the second quarter of this Super Bowl. An eight-play drive to this point. So here's play number nine on third and seven. Looking to throw. Rich targeting Thomas on the out route, making the catch. Touchdown, Washington. Logan Thomas, a seven-yard touchdown grab as they have taken the lead. The big fellow was the recipient there for that touchdown pass, and it seems like more and more the tight end is the guy you have to worry about most in the passing game. Now McManus to tack on the extra point. It's up and good, and that'll make the score 21-14. So that drive consumes nine plays all told. And it was capped off by the Logan Thomas touchdown catch. Washington kick team back out there now as they will send this one away. This fielded right at the goal line. And he'll get it up past the 20 to about the 22. Here's the Kansas City offense now as they get set to take over. And two interceptions thrown here in this first half. You hear it no matter the sport, they say the great athletes, they can kind of have a short-term memory, but that's easier said than done. It is easier said than done, but I played with a guy who threw two interceptions in the first quarter of a really big game we were playing. Johnny Unitas? And no, not, not quite of that level <laughs> and not of that age. But I remember I was looking, going for the age. I remember looking over at him, and he was smiling. And I thought, what is he smiling about? It's because he had enough confidence in himself that eh, well, that was a fluke. And he went out and played pretty well the rest of the day. On first and ten, here's Mahomes. Now a swing pass. It's Edwards Alaire. And they'll get this down to the 42-yard line. The Chiefs now going to use the first of their timeouts as they'll stop it with a tick under a minute to go before half. To throw again on second down. Mahomes being chased out left. And he's going to be taken down just shy of the 35. Now another timeout called for by the offense as they get the stoppage with a little over 50 seconds to go in the first half. Mahomes now on first down. Steps away to his left. It's caught by Aguilar. 
And he'll be brought down at the 27. So not quite a first down just yet as they come up on second and less than a yard. And his throw is incomplete. Play number seven coming on this drive. It's third and inches. Working from the gun, Mahomes. Nowhere to go here. He lost the football. So they escape, so to speak, maintaining the football. Defensively, though, opportunity miss. It definitely was because that's all defenses talk about, getting the football and either advancing it the other way or just getting possession and turning it over to their offense. That could be a little bit deflating. You're exactly right, a lost opportunity. Okay, Brandon, thanks very much. What a season this has been. Hard to believe it ends tonight as we'll get back to you guys for the second half of this Super Bowl in just a moment. It's been a tremendous season from beginning to end. And now we'll play one half of football to decide who raises the Lombardi Trophy. And for the call, let's get it right back to Brandon and Charles. Coach, thanks. Yeah, both teams likely to make some changes in what's been a closely fought battle to this point. These two teams sat through a longer than usual 30-minute wait, but we're back in action here in this Super Bowl. And they'll get him down inside the 30 at the 27. Here comes the Chiefs offensive unit as they'll have it to begin quarter number three. And they trail here in the Super Bowl, but fortunately for them, Charles, very much still within striking range. Yeah, things didn't go exactly the way they planned in the first half. To me, they appeared to be a little bit tight, made a few errors they normally wouldn't. But of course, this is the Super Bowl, so things get a little bit heightened in that regard. But I think they have to feel a little fortunate. They're only down what they are here starting the third quarter. On second down, a run with Edwards Alaire. And the big boys up front, they're going to stop him right at the line. Call it no gain that time as it's going to leave him with a third and about three to go. Here's Edwards Hilaire. And he's got the first before he's brought down at the 39-yard line. The gain of four that time as the drive continues. Well, they're hoping that the second half is better for him than the first half. They've got to find a way to get him going. He's a big part of their offense. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Mahomes going to throw. It's Kelsey on the ground. And they're going to get this up to midfield. A couple of first downs right in succession, and this is an offense that can really use a good drive, and they're off to a fast start here. Edwards Alaire as they run out of the gun. And this time they were waiting for him as he'll be knocked down before he can get back to the line of scrimmage. Officially, it's a one-yard loss. That's going to bring up second and 11. He's still having trouble moving the ball on the ground. Yeah, so much for halftime adjustment. Sometimes the best adjustment you make is no adjustment. You just do things better. But in this case, I think an adjustment was in order. They may have to change up and start throwing the ball around a little bit more. Looking at a second and 11 now after the loss. Now here's Mahomes. Caught, Kelsey, left side. And he'll be brought down just shy of the 40. This will be play number seven on the drive. Third and a yard. They'll run. It's Edwards Alaire. And he's going to have the first down at about the 38. They're able to convert with a gain of four. Third and one, partner. No need to be fancy there. Just use some force and move forward and pick up the first down. On 
play action, it's Mahomes. Flushed out right. And he's going to be taken down just shy of the 35. Looking to throw again on second down. Mahomes. And that'll be off the mark too far out in front, and it's incomplete. So third down, they need to get to the 28 for a first. From the gun, it's Mahomes. And this is going to be incomplete. So on fourth down, Mahomes off. Harrison Butker on for the Chiefs field goal. Butker's kick here is good. And that'll bring him back within four. These kickers now it used to be that a 50-plus yarder was cause for celebration, now seemingly automatic. Yeah, isn't it funny? When we prepare for a game, when you look at the backgrounds of these kickers, it's interesting, isn't it, to find out they were all-state quarterbacks, receivers, defensive backs, all-state wrestlers, right, baseball players. We're finding athletes all along, and now they're just specialists putting it through the posts. First chance for the commander's offense now as they head out for their opening series in the second half. Throwing to start the drive. Rich, middle of the field, he's got McLaurin. And he'll be upended at the 28-yard line. Just a three-yard gain there. Here's second and seven now from the 28. Back to throw. Rich, and yet again, it's McLaurin. A pickup of about three yards as he's taken down at the 31. From the gun on third down, Rich. He's got a man complete. Now he's going to get this all the way down inside the 35. A great pick up there, 35 yards, and obviously the first down to go along with it. They came out with an aggressive mindset to start the third quarter, and I wouldn't be surprised to see them take more of these type of deep shots as this game moves along. They connected there. They expect to connect on more before this one's over. So the big play changes the complexion of things. Here's first and 10, just outside the 30. Movement there on the offensive line, a little quick, and a five-yard penalty. A full start backs him up five, first and 15. Again, he'll drop to throw. Got his man complete over the middle. That's Thomas. And he's going to be taken down at the 28-yard line. An inside give, Brown. And he'll go down here right around the 23-yard line. <laughs> Throwing on first down, Rich. And he's going to go down. They sack him back right around the 30. It'll be a loss of seven on the sack, and it brings up second. You know, on these types of plays, we're always looking to assess blame. Okay, where did it break down? Sometimes it's just a great play. Don't need it all back at once, but you figure they're going to need something here. 17 yards to go on second down. This is Brown going up the middle. And he went nowhere. Well, he went backwards, back to the 33. It's a loss of four. Now third down. That's a nice job there, foiling what all offenses try to do, which is control the defensive end in the running game. They want to get to the outside. And if he keeps himself free, stays on his feet, he can make a play just as he did there.
Need something from deep in the bag of tricks here after first and second down went backwards. It's third and very long. From the shotgun, he'll look to throw. And Thomas has it. And he'll get this to the 23, but that'll be well short of what he needed. They do get 10 back, but still a ways to go on fourth. Now McManus will line up for the field goal. From the right hash, this from an even 40 yards out. The kick by McManus is good. And they will open their lead up to a touchdown at 24-17. So the scoring drive encompasses nine plays, and the net result, three points. Take your disappointment and put it aside. Nine plays. Yeah, they want to end up in the end zone with a touchdown. I get that. But sometimes those nine-play drives pay dividends later with another nine-play drive that culminates in a touchdown when they wear down a defense. Out now the Chiefs offensive unit ready to do battle again. Last time out, you remember their drive stalled, but thanks to their kicker, booted a long field goal to at least get them three. Now here they'll try to do better and find the end zone. And in our experience, how much fun is it for coaches to know that they've got a kicker who can nail it from long distance? Now the hard part is, as an offensive play caller, you don't want that in your head too much where you're relying on it. And he goes out and gets the job done for them. But I'm quite sure he would be content to just kick extra points from here on out. Yeah, absolutely no question. I think his teammates would be okay with him just kicking the extra points as well. And the officials here are going to pause the game for a second. Looks like there's an injured chief on the field. The medical staff will attend to him, and we will step aside. So from the 39 now, they'll come up on a first and 10. Looking to throw is Mahomes. Out right and brought in by Moore. It'll be a gain of five, and it'll be second down. Now it's Mahomes again. And Mahomes misfires again, and it's intercepted. Picked off by Alexander Johnson. And the Commanders are going to take possession of the football. That throw, Charles, over the middle of the field, and a few too many bodies in there got picked. That's a normal situation, too, isn't it? No matter how hard you try and spread the field sometimes, there's always going to be a traffic jam, it feels like, towards the middle. And if there's any type of a missed throw, or maybe the ball's tipped, or just too many bodies in the area, an interception can result. So from inside the 20, here's first and 10 at the 18. Throwing to start the drive. Rich dancing to his left. That's complete to his receiver, McLaurin. And he is out of bounds, getting it down to the 10. They'll wind up getting seven on the play, and it's second down. He was out there waving his arms, and when you got a quarterback out of the pocket looking for any help, I guess waving the arms is helpful. It certainly is, because you got to get his attention, because now you're in scramble drill. So everyone's adjusting their routes, finding open space, and he found the right spot for the completion. Looking to throw. Rich. The quick slant caught. Touchdown! Woo! Terry McLaurin, his second touchdown of this Super Bowl. And the Commanders will extend their third quarter lead here in this Super Bowl. In order to lead in a game, you're going to get plenty of contributors, but that's his second touchdown catch of this game. He's one of the key guys in this one. And you better believe he'll be looking for the hat trick here as this one continues to go. McManus now for the extra point. And the lead is up to 14. The drive there only spanning three plays. And it's finished off by a Terry McLaurin touchdown. Kick 